what's up you guys, Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music and I'm gonna give you guys 10 super easy electric songs that you can play as a beginner. I have links for full tutorials on all of these in the links below. Also, if you haven't yet subscribed here to the channel, I appreciate that as well. All right, here we go. First up, we have TNT by ACDC. Now, if you're a super beginner, you can start with the O, three, and five on your on your low E string right here. O, three, five, three, five, three, O, three, five, three, five, three, O, three, five, three, five, three, O, three, five, and then you would have five, three, O, five, three, O. But those can be translated into basic power chords. E power chord. The G note on the third fret of the E string. And then an A power chord, which is the open A string second fret D. E, a G note, and an A. is Blitzkrieg Bop by the Ramones. Now, in the easiest form, you remember this is for beginners, uh, it's an A, which is the fifth fret of the E string, and then D, D, E, and you can do that on the fifth fret A string is D, and seventh fret is E, so. And then a little turnaround, A, 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 D, 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 A, 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 A. You can turn that into a power chord. A two finger power chord or a three finger power chord. Next song uses the exact same chords, and it's Wild Thing, originally by the Trogs, but a lot of different people have done it, including Jimi Hendrix. It's A, D, and E again, and the rhythm's just a little different. <laughs> Other change G A G A, and there's different ways to play that. But for a beginner, you've got the third fret is G, and the fifth fret on that E string is A. So G A G A, <clears throat> but I want to know for sure, like that. Next is Smoke on the Water, and as a super beginner, we can play in a different key using these open E 
the three and the five, and then a little bit of that six fret in there. So this is a great, just recognizable thing you can do on one string if you're just really starting out, and it would be O, three, five, O, three, six, five, O, three, five, three, O. Again, O, three, five, O, three, six, five, O, three, five, three, O. Now, the original song is in uh, the key of G, actually. And another way you could play along with the recording would be to play a power chord like this, uh, starting on G, third fret, and then fifth fret A, and then fifth fret D. And so that's the third fret root there. So you'd go three, six, eight, three, six, nine, eight, three, six, eight, six, three, and that would sound like this. Now, what's kind of fun too is you look at the, that part of it and forget the root, and you just use one finger. is Seven Nation Army by the White Stripes, and we're gonna do uh, a beginner version of it. And I'm gonna start up on the 12th fret of that E string. Hit it again, and then go up to 15. Back to 12, then 10, then eight, then seven. So that looks like this. Part three, 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 five, 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 five. by Green Day. Now, the original, you would tune your guitar a half step down on each string, and then you would play it exactly like I'm playing it. I'm gonna just show it to you in standard tuning right now, um, but to match up to the recording, they're tuned one half step down on each string. So we're gonna start on the A power chord, and I'm gonna play fifth fret, seventh fret, and seventh fret on the D. We're just gonna judge it and then mute it. That's the fifth fret. Then we go to the third fret. Then we go to the second fret. Then we go to the first fret. Then the open, and you can just slide that ring and pinky down to hit that last one. So five, five, three, three, two, two, one, one, oh, oh, five, five, three, three, two, two, one, one, oh, oh. Thank you. 
Next is Rolling Stone's Satisfaction. And this is obviously one of the classic riffs of all time. And you're gonna focus on the A string, second fret. Two, 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 four, five. Five, 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 four. So two, 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 four, five, 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 four. So five, 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 four, four, two, 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 four, five, 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 four. Rockin' in the Free World by Neil Young. It's uh, we're gonna use distortion, but with the open power or open cowboy chords: E minor, D to C. And that's the main part. Next part, G, D, and C. And it does a little walk down to E minor. all the small things it's uh basically three chords it's a c chord which we're gonna do as a power chord uh we can do it right here on the eighth fret and then a g power chord which will be on the third fret and then an f which will be on the first fret we have c g f g c Nirvana, Smells Like Teen Spirit, uh, power chords again. We're gonna start on the first fret with the E string power chord. And I teach it down, up, down, even though we started with the upstroke. Uh, down, up, down, 
and then down, down on the B flat. You just go right next door to the first fret on the A string. Then, fourth fret, power chord on the E string, same rhythm. Right next door to the fourth fret on the A string. You have down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, chicky, chicky, down, 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 up, down, chicky, chicky. And that's just your muting with your left hand, and you get that muted sound. notes is the bass line and the little bong bong is just the first fret of the B to the high E. And then uh, on the oh no 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 you just go and rock it out down 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 all right you guys thanks so much for watching i hope you had fun with that and also please let me know songs that you think should have been on this list and I can do a follow-up for you guys. So let me know in the comments below what other songs need to be in there for easy uh, beginner electric songs. Uh, thanks again. Hopefully you subscribe here to Marty Music YouTube channel. And hope to see you again real soon. Take care.